Hello and welcome to another episode of the Micronesian News Broadcast. I'm PJ and thanks for tuning in. In an article that was recently published by the FSM Public Information Office, the current FSM administration, the Panuelo administration, is taking precautions to ensure FSM citizens don't get entangled in the current effort by the current Trump administration in the USA to oust illegal or undocumented immigrants. According to a report from the Department of Homeland Security entitled Fiscal Year 2018 Entry Exit Oversight Report, Overstay Report, the FSM is listed as one of the nations of having overstays in the United States. The FSM Embassy in Washington, D.C. is actually working with the Department of State to ensure that FSM citizens aren't adversely affected. The Panuelo administration would like to encourage FSM citizens in the United States and its territories to remain calm and refrain from you know, suspicious activities that would that are unacceptable or that can cause deportation or, or other adverse, adverse effects upon you know, some citizens. And they would, they would also let you, like to let you know that if you have any information, you can contact the FSM Embassy in Washington, D.C. or the FSM Consulates in Guam, Hawaii, or Portland, Oregon. Here is our take. Roll the clip. And according to the Compact of Free Association that was amended in 2003 in section, in section 141 regarding immigration, FSM citizens can travel to, live in, and seek occupation in the United States and its territories as non-immigrants. We must all remain calm and be assured that no deportations will occur, you know, unless you've actually committed crimes or have insufficient means of support. As stated in Article 141, uh, Part F, Art, Paragraph 1, Page 63 of the Compact. You know, stuff like running around, slashing at people with machetes, like these two guys that that deportation would actually be justified. We must also remember that the Compact of Free Association is also a part of U.S. law, a special relationship that is shared between the United States of America and the freely associated states. It's binding. The United States takes full responsibility and authority when it comes to the defense of the FAS nations, and furthermore has control of the air and water, as a security precaution, of course. The relationship our nations share is one where we get so much by sighting with the biggest, baddest shark in the water, and we benefit immensely. So, all my islanders out there, please remain calm and don't do anything ridiculous that would get you otherwise deported. And that is our take from the hashtag MEB Squad. See you in the next episode.